What would Jamie do? I'm not good with text texticles, tentacles. What what do you say that? How do you say that? Kopchang. Intense. Intense. <laughs> oh, that's why she was like, <laughs> okay, In- intestines. What? Oh, intestines. Okay, I'm not. I'm not a fan of intestines. But in Korea, you guys, you guys um eat pigs' intestines, cows' intestines, and all that shit. Yo, you guys are crazy. Why would you eat something's intestines? I don't. I don't fucking know how to. Kopchang. It's called Kopchang, Techang, Bakchang. I don't like the Chang Cha Dolim friends. There's Kopchang, Techang, Bakchang in Korea that I'm not friends with. And it's just so greasy. I don't really like it, but a lot of Koreans enjoy it. So that was my picky things. Cause usually when they drink, when my friends go out to drink or if there's like any parties after, they usually go to a Kopchang, Kopchang, Techang, Bakchang chip. And I'll be like, <laughs> I'm leaving. And so, and there's this episode. So cooking is going to be a really big disaster or a really big trauma for someone. Because actually, I tried cooking to one, to one of my um, boyfriends that I dated. Because, you know, like every girlfriend wants to be like a cute little darling to their stupid shit. Um, so I tried this Korean chicken stew, which is called takdori tang. And if you try it in these amazing restaurants, it's going to be one of your best foods. But uh, I tried it. Stupid of me. So I bought this chicken, this rare chicken. I chopped it off. I chopped off the like the bones and stuff and all these like poop shit. And then I need, I need to stew it. I made the sauce. I chopped potatoes, carrots and everything and put it in. And then I kind of waited. So I asked my mom, like, how, how many minutes do I have to take? And she's like, at least like 15 to 20 minutes. So I've been like watching TV and like doing my own stuff. And then I, 20 minutes passed. I opened the stew. It looks great. I was like, oh, hmm, maybe I don't need to sing. So <laughs> my boyfriend came, my ex-boyfriend came and I opened the stew. It was a little different from what I saw the last 30 minutes. So I was like, huh, okay. And then it was kind of cold, so I needed to stew it again. And then I was like, just, you know, stirring it. I was like, huh. Where's the chickens? <laughs> where where are all the chickens? Like, the bones were there, but then, like, the chickens were not there. So I was like, hmm. So, I overcooked it so much. <laughs> the chickens were like... Dripping off the bone. And it was one of like those chook. Like chicken chook. What do you say that? Chicken porridge. So the chicken literally went to chicken to a porridge. And then I was like, here. And then he was like, oh. Where's the chicken? And he needed to like scoop it up and eat it. And then he broke up with me like next week. Like the week later, yeah. But I don't know if that's the reason. But I think that's the reason. And that's a trauma for me. So I don't cook anymore. I only cook ramen for your motherfuckers. So what's up? (laughs) What would Jamie do?